what is going on everybody reset renegade here resetrenegade.com check out the links in the description below first link goes to the other channel second link goes to the website um, off on another thrifty Thursday mission tonight uh, I actually did make one for you guys last week I just didn't upload it because I didn't find anything good and I didn't really go that many places tonight's gonna be a similar type situation so hopefully I find something good because I'm only gonna hit three spots the same three spots that I generally hit on most Wednesday nights. Trying to get ahead on this whole thing here. Um, but yeah, looking for home runs. Not looking for onesie twosies. That's the name of the game for me lately. Because I don't have a whole lot of time. It's coming up on the holiday season. And I got other stuff going on that's taking up a little bit more of my time than usual. So, come along for the ride. Let's see if we can find something good. Goodwill one. Goodwill down. Nothing so to speak. There's a couple interesting things though. There, I mean, that brown case that I was interested in, that was a Kodak 4400 slide projector. They're all over the map on prices, so I didn't swing on it because I didn't have enough time to sit there and look. I'd rather go to this other Goodwill and find out if there's anything there. No one's going to buy that thing tonight. Worst case scenario, if I change my mind, I'll go back first thing in the morning and grab it. The airplane was interesting, but that was just interesting for me. It wasn't a home run. Um, the archery case didn't have a brand name on it, even though it looked like a really nice archery case. Um, too big and bulky for me to ship, so I didn't want to deal with that. And the microscope would have been fun, but it was not a good seller. So, win some, you lose some. There's definitely some interesting stuff there, just nothing that was a home run to me. On to the next one. Here we go. This dude must have found some stuff. Sometimes I wonder what they're doing with that. I bet you they're shipping it back to Mexico. Goodwill too. Let's see how we do. This place is cleaned out. that I don't know about these places. They're all like cleaned out. It's weird for Wednesday. Seriously. This place is kind of clean. That's scary. Are they going out of business? This place, this one is never clean. Ever. That 
shelf is generally overflowing with stuff. What are you? Schwinn? Mm. Pretty rough around the edges. But ape hangers and a banana seat. Schwinn Stingray. Fair lady. Throwing hundred dollars for this thing. What do you think? I have to do some research before I shell out that kind of cash on this thing right rusted to shit. I think. Alright, so the only thing really interesting at that place is the Shin that Schwinn Stingray. I don't think that it was a the model they thought it was. I want to say, I don't know, I don't know Schwinn bikes that well, to be quite honest. All I do know is that it was pretty rusted and it was pretty far away from being put back together, which is pretty much what collectors and such are looking for in that kind of a bike. And I don't want to drop a hundred bucks and not know for a fact that I could at least get 200 for it. And all the good looking ones that were the regular Schwinn Fair Ladies on um, eBay are only like 250 so I'm probably not gonna get anything better than a hundred bucks if that so I passed but on to the old savers see what we can find here apparently something happened because this place is dry too I know that. hmm not much here. Well, three strikes, I'm out. Savers, you did me wrong. Both Goodwills did me wrong too. I did that all in about 45 minutes, so it wasn't too big of a waste of time. I don't know what happened. There was something that was like, <sighs> Something went on, obviously, because there was nothing in any of those places. They were all pretty much cleaned out. It's like they went through and did like some spring cleaning, only it's not spring. So, I don't know what the deal is with that. But, sorry I didn't score anything awesome and fantastic for you guys on this video. Thank you for coming along for the ride. I appreciate it. I'm going to go ahead and put this video out anyway, because, uh... It's thrifty Thursday. It's not guaranteed home run Thursday, I guess. So I'm gonna put it out anyway. Thanks for coming along for the ride. If you liked the video, please like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. I am going to be doing a Q&A series as well. Um, so if you have questions regarding resale, regarding business in general, regarding eBay, Amazon, anything like that, go ahead and leave them in the comments below. I'll try and make you a video. I've already done a couple of them. I was gonna upload them relatively soon. And, uh, yeah, see what kind of response I get from that. So, I will see you guys in the next video. Again, thank you for watching. See you next time.